You can't say it, but you know it's true. All right, winners aren't losers by Donald J. Trump. Winners aren't losers, they're winners like me. A loser's a loser. Which one will you be? <laughs> winners do deals and winners get rich, while sad little losers just sit there and bitch. <laughs> My daughter loves me. The dog is a loser, and frankly, I pity it. This dog did bad deals. This dog is an idiot. <laughs> And poor Mr. Bear, he must feel like a loser, valeting that 2006 PT Cruiser. This lobster's a loser. Throw him in the pot. I like a lobster who doesn't get caught. Those losers are failures who get nothing done. Just do what I do and you'll be number one. Now, here are some frogs I do not like at all. We must kick these frogs out and then build a wall. Oh, the places you'll go on your yacht, on your plane, with your suits from Milan and your wives from Ukraine. Oh, the buildings you'll build, oh, the wealth you'll amass, oh, the people around you all kissing your ass. There are two kinds of people. Which one will you be? A loser like them, would you like to finish? Or a winner like me? Donald Trump, everybody! So what I'm talking about right now, I'm talking about having a little bit of empathy. Which brings me to Colin Kaepernick. I am not going to watch, um, I'm not going to watch any part of this story. Only thing I'm, I'm just going to listen to what he says. Which is, I think, you know, I'm not going to sit here and these fucking assholes on sports radio are going to try to get me all fucking stirred up. Like, what he's doing is going to somehow bring down this country. And second of all, like, I'm going to sit, I can't, I cannot sit there and listen to a bunch of people act like they don't understand where this is coming from. You know what I mean? This is a good time, I think. I don't know. I, you know what? I'm not going to tell you what to do. But I think this is, for me personally, I'm like, you know what? I'm a white male heterosexual. I could basically, within reason, do whatever the fuck I want to do. Here's a guy who's making zillions of fucking dollars and he still feels this way. This is, this is, I should probably shut the fuck up and listen to what he has to say. What's your thought on, on Black Lives Matter? What is it? What, what do you mean? The idea is that there's this movement called Black Lives Matter thinking that the rest of America didn't seem to understand that, that Black Lives Matter. That just sounds weird. I don't know that you put a name on it. It's not a name. It's not whatever, whatever. If somebody got shot by a police for a reason. I am a young, black, rich If that don't let you know that America understand black matter these days, I don't know what it is. Don't come at me with that dumb man. My life matters, especially to my Do you separate yourself from it? I don't feel connected to a damn thing that ain't got nothing to do with me. If you do, you crazy. You. <laughs> And basically, it's not legal, is it? Of course it's legal. It's a war. <laughs> Until the war is over, anything's legal. And with that, I just have two more words to say. Obama. I think that obviously. This business is the beast. Yeah. And it eats everybody and shits them out. But here's what's funny about the beast. It's a never-ending line of people who want to get in the mouth and get <laughs> chewed up and shit out. Why is that? It's because you, when you get in the belly, yeah. you get $2 million a week. <laughs> the end of the Republic has never looked better. <laughs>